Better keep this short and sweet. Two brainwashed sex zombies in a single day is too much, even for me. Hard day. More like hard life. This place always this dead? Thought I heard a tumbleweed roll by. Dead for you. Lively for others. For me? Just right. What can I get you? Something might have gone wrong here. Not really sure, uh... I don't have your details? Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. You sure your VIP card checks Relax. out? Relax. You don't need any data, don't need any deets. I'm not a customer. I'm here to talk. To you specifically. Not to be with a doll. Tom, is that it? Uh-huh. I need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Tried calling her a bunch of times. No luck. You mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. Which was it? Osaka or Oslo? Uh, Oslo. Yeah, definitely Oslo. Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so... I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Where can I find this Woodman? 
probably got his feet up in the back office. Except it's off limits to customers. Woodman, who is he? Mr. Forrest. But everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest then. What's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. So why, every time, do they restart the conversation? A washing machine has a motor. Uh, can we? Tiger calls Moonlight as peeping toms. They always got eyes in their dolls. Then, data mind to be. Saw that twist coming a mile away. Had a hunch. Still, wonder if it's for their own use or for sale, and who'd be buying. Clients allowed in here. Be a chum and close the door on your way out, would you? As you can see, 
I'm very busy. Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. Got nobody working here by that name. But she used to. What happened to her? Probably did what all the dolls try to do. Found a unicorn to set her up for life. Ah, you could do better. Try Roxy over at Booth too. Same heart-shaped ass. Behavioral chip will do the rest. Won't feel any difference. You look to me like a reasonable man. I think we can work something out. And you look to me like a psycho prick who's never been ghosted by his bow or bill before. But go on. I'm listening. You sit here in this dank hole you probably call your office and think you've got it made, don't you? Congrats! You read minds better than our own fucking AI. Someone get this gonker job. Ever stop to think who's behind the tiger claw puppets you call your bosses? Tiger claw bosses have got their own bosses, in case you didn't know. You're just too small to see them. <laughs> oh, cause you're such a big shot. Let's just say a certain member of the Arasaka clan wouldn't be pleased if he knew something bad happened to Evelyn, and that you're the one responsible. All right, fine. I'll lay it on you straight. Girl you're looking for, Parker? She ain't here. Tell me something I don't know. Like, where is she? Think you know how things work around here, but you don't know shit. Dolls aren't here to give you pleasure and satisfaction out of the goodness of their soul. They're workers. Their job's to generate profit. Evelyn stopped pulling profit. No denying that, sadly for her. Her chip was busted up pretty damn good. By who? A client? No, outside job. Some kind of crack shot net runner. Punched through our ice like it was cheap wallpaper. Girl was a vegetable. Believe you me, we tried to fix it. Didn't even come close. They common? These kind of accidents? Ever use tech that never broke? Didn't think so. Behavioural chip splits you right down the middle. Some people plain lose their minds. And for everyone that does, there's a dozen in line to replace them. Is this you talking it out straight? What happened to Evelyn? Got an order from up high to recycle her. You killed her? No. I found a ripper doc who was willing to take a look. Yeah, he said he knew something or other. You took her to the Ripper instead of following orders. Didn't take you for someone with balls. For fuck's sake, I'm not running a slaughterhouse here. Only recycle as a last resort. And family always gets a call. If there is any. Think there are any daddies out there willing to change the diapers of a brain-dead little slut on the verge of cyberpsychosis? Probably not. Casting him out on the street ain't an option either. Can't risk tanking our crit. Well, anything's better than a bullet to the brain. <laughs> you know, that's what every doll says. I'm starting to like you. You looking for work by any chance? You invested your own eddies to help poor, unprofitable Evelyn. Please. <laughs> you got me. Ripper's the one who paid me. For a broken doll. People got all kinds of kinks. Trust me. I know, considering where I work. Fingers is a real specimen, though. Got all the fetishes. Even the ones you've never heard of. I'm sure he found her a nice niche. <laughs> the 
the Ripper. Name and address. Died an hour last night. Don't fuck with me. I'm not. Goes by fingers. Clinic's in some godforsaken alley up on Jig Jig Street. Wanna find Evelyn? Look there. And don't come back here. Ever. While you're at it, take the elevator. The quicker you're out of here, the better. Dark fingers on Jig Jig Street. Sounds like a co-ed's wet dream. weapons. A pleasant day to you. The next time you have that urge for clouds, don't wait. Real charm, this place. In that slimy, subterranean kind of way. You think Fingers got her? I think we'll find her there. V, if I could see that far, I wouldn't be a fucking ghost on a chip in a corpse's head right now. See, your opinion about dollhouses hasn't changed. Oh, but it has. Before, I wouldn't have touched one with a ten-mile pole. Now I'm thinking a fire would really make this place shine.
Vlad. Don't look in any condition to find help. Oh, fuck! What the hell's that? No, no, damn it! Jesus, the fuck do you want from me? It's all going too slow. Gonna decommission before we learn how to rip the chip out. Wanted me dead. Said so yourself. Made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind. Want you to live now. Asked you already. What the hell you want from me? I got a get out of jail free card. I'd be a fucking fool not to take advantage. See, me and Arasaka, we got a half-century-old score neat settling, and I plan to do it. That's what I need you for. Never been recruited into a terrorist cell before. Feel Listen, honored, I actually. know things. Where we can save your life, who can help us do that? You'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. Win-win, kid. Soul Killer's what we need, and Makoshi's how we grab it. You know you're just an irritating hallucination, right? Should just ignore you. And you're a walking corpse. Should just wait till your mind shrivels to nothing and frees up space for me. You fucking asshole. But as should be obvious, I've decided to help you. Need to find something first. Seven letters. Starts with an M. Okay, so... This Makoshi... What is it exactly? Okay, basics. If you're jacked in, cruising the net, Arasaka can use Soul Killer, an AI, to trap, fry, and pack away your psyche, your mind, and your soul. Following so far? Seen the memories. Did a real number on you. Okay, seems we've got a few more things to broach than I thought, but that'll come later. Anyway, when Soul Killer fries, roasts, and boils you, you die. But the contents of your mind get copied to an engram first. Sure. That's how you became a construct. Exactly. Now, Makoshi's the place Soul Killer operates out of where it stores its victims' engrams. Still don't see how Mikoshi's linked to my chip problem. Not the brightest bulb on stage, are ya? Fifty years back, ops on the human mind. Mikoshi was the sole place on Earth where they did anything like that. <sighs> Bet it still is today. Telling you, all roads lead there. It's where we'll settle our biz. You yours, me mine. And, uh, how you plan to smash Arasaka this time? Got another nuke tucked away? This time, bomb's named Alt Cunningham. I'm supposed to know who that is? Not yet. But you will once we find what we need. For now, we got no time to lose. Need to get inside, Makoshi. What do you want?
vibe. Place has a wicked vibe. See, so this more up your alley than clouds. Hey, at least here you know what you're getting. Here, Katie, Katie, what's the rush? He tipped you for free? Fuck off! Yeah, gear looks a little basic, but it works. So he didn't ask for any money? Nada? Not even stockings? Like I said, just finish this. Dee, can you talk? It is important. What's important? I may have found a solution to the problem we share. I have established a contact with an old friend from Arasaka. He's here in Night City now. He's well connected to certain influential people. That's gonna help us how hey, exactly? Not one step There will be a meeting. Here's you, me, and this friend of mine. You will tell him what you told me. The truth of events at Kompiki Brother. I have little hope that he will be convinced. But it will be a start. Of all people, you ought to know Night City tests everyone's reliability, even that of old friends. You sure about this guy? Trust him? Many times we have had the opportunity to kill one another. Yes, I trust him. Fine, where's the meat and when? Japan Town. After sunset, I am sending you the precise location. I'll see you there. Mr. Stafford, my wife, the Auto up to Bredo. Looking for a ripper doc, goes by fingers. Know where I can find him? Who's asking? And why? Got a problem with an implant. Not from around here. Couldn't find another ripper in the city to patch you up? Red Fingers was the best. Yeah, the best for joy girls. Are you a whore? No, but you are, from the look of things. Yo, you hear what this motherfucker said to me? Best watch your tongue. I'd say it again, but what for? Your little skull sponge can't possibly get its gray cells around it. Best apologize for that, asshole! You gotta be worth a damn to get an apology from me. And your trash, not worth shit. Nobody talks that way to little loco! Woo! That's right! Uh. You get him, boy! Uh. Uh. Get it, your skinny ass. You no, no. will be when I'd, every I'd month rather live here. descends on this shithole. Don't turn off the lights. You got a financial claim? Take it to court. Means rain. I have to sit in the basement the whole time. All right, I get it. Everyone's got their breaking point. Just pay me what you owe me, and you can fuck off the greener pastures. But you do. And that shit has a name. Something around 20 thou. What? Come on, you pulled that number out of your ass. I hope that teaches those candy ass scotch suckers Made not to come around here no here, more. Huh? Must really want to talk to Evelyn. You want out? You got to pay back. Hello? There's a line. Nuh uh, you ain't cutting. 
Sit your ass down and wait your turn. Fingers guy. You know him? Heard some things, yeah. Like? His hand sometimes slips. What are you even doing here, Judy? Same thing as you. Looking for Evelyn. How'd you know to look for Evelyn here? Got friends at Clouds. Word spreads out of there quicker.